Hey guys, my name is Mike and welcome back to AXC Garage, a channel that's built for today's Acuras, Hondas, and all the classics. On the last episode, you saw us put everything back in the engine bay, the car sounding really, really good. In today's episode, we actually got some new wheels and tires. Let's go get Dave, the owner of the car, and see what he got. Hey Dave. Hey Mike. What you got here, man? Right here, we got a set of brand new rims and tires for the Civic Type R. We went with the Rays from Volk Racing. These are 18 by nine and a half, 35 offset. Oh, you know, the funny thing is, you know, there are some question in terms of what size you should go with, 18 or 19. Obviously 20, everybody thinks is a little bit too big for the car. It's a little big, I, so I agree. What what is your thought between 18 versus 19? There's, there's gonna be some back and forth on this topic. Uh, I read through the forums and asked other people's opinions. 19 is going to be as close as you can get to the OEM spec rim, which is the 20-inch tire, which is on the car currently right now. So for tracking and everything else, I would recommend the 19s. But because I'm going to keep these tires for daily use and the stock rims for tracking, I went with the 18s just to give it a little bit more of an aggressive look because I think it just sits better on this Honda Civic like that. Now let me ask you a question. Seeing you mentioned about tracking, I do see you got some interesting tires right over here. Yeah. Let's I, talk about the tire first. So the tires I went with, of course, are going to be the Michelin Pilot Sport 4S. The reason I went with these is because due to the mods and everything done to the car, it's starting to spin tires and these, these babies right here hook and stick like nothing. As you can see, I went with the Gram Lights and Mag Blue. The reason I picked this color is because on my other Integra Type R, if you guys follow me and see, it's also Volk T37 and Mag Blue. And being having two Type R's, I wanted to keep them similar in some, some type of way. Man, those are really cool wheels. Let's go ahead and get with John and get those wheels and tire mounted. Wow, those are some real cool looking wheels. Yeah, they're really nice. You know, nice brand new. That means all the install is gonna be good. They're gonna bounce out real nice, especially with these Michelin PS4s. It's so gonna be really nice. what is the first thing we're gonna do now? So we're gonna get them on the machine, get the tires mounted, then over to the balancer. And after that, we're ready to go out there and burn the rubber off these things. Let's get that started.
All right, so the rims and the tires are already installed. Now we're gonna find out how much weight saving we're gonna have stock versus the aftermarket 18 inch wheels. So first thing is, let's go ahead and get the, eight, uh, the OEM wheels on the scale. Those 20s. Let's go, baby. All right. So 51 is the number for the stock wheels. So let's go ahead and get these bad boys on it. Are we good? Oh yeah. 46.4. So it's about uh, four and a half pounds. I'm not too good in math, but it sounds good to me. So we just find out how much weight saving we have, the stock versus the 18 inch. Now it's time to install the wheels. All right guys, so we got a little debate over here. So we got these wheels. They are arguing based on the wheels should have center cap or no center caps. Center caps? I'm used to old school rims never having a center cap. Well guys, comment below, let us know what you think. Center cap or no center caps? Think, Dave? I'm in love with the car all over again. I love the championship white and the mag blue finish combo together. And I love how the 18s are looking on the Civic Type R 10 gen right now, sitting on the Eibach Pro Kit Springs. Well, I hope you like the videos. If you do, make sure you hit the subscribe button and don't forget to turn on your notifications so you don't miss anything of this entire channel. And don't forget, we're still on the website www.acrohonaclassics.com to pick up your favorite apparel and merchandise. This is it for the videos. Thank you so much for watching. We hope to see you guys on the next one. <laughs>